Hey, what's up everybody? Brian here with the Holy Roller playing craps on a cruise to earn a free cruise. And today I'm showing you the optimal, the best strategy that I would use if I had $400 at the craps table. $400 strategy, here we go. Welcome to the Holy Roller where it's all about playing craps, earning free cruises, and a whole lot more. Thanks for watching, now let's get rolling. All right, I've been trying to do different strategy amounts as far as like 300, 400, five, seven, Forget about 600, <laughs> just jump up to 700, then a thousand. But a lot of times people have $400. And so this is a strategy that I will use for $400. Now, I know you know enough by now, if you've been watching it any time, you know that that is $40 per shooter because you should always take your bankroll and divide it by 10 so you have enough for 10 shooters. So 400 divided by 10 is $40 per shooter. So what we're going to do is we're going to use $40 per shooter to see if we can make some money. Okay. And we're going to play for 10 sevens, if you would, 10 shooters or 10 sevens. Okay. And we're going to call this strategy 10, four over and out, 10, four over and out. We're going to get a 10 and a four, $10 on the 10, $10 on the four. And it's a CB radio, right? So 10-4, good old buddy, over and out. Okay, so 10-4 is a CB radio. So we could call it 10-4 CB radio over and out. That's a long name. So I'm going with 10-4 over and out. But 10-4 CB is what you need to know because you take the same amount. That's 10-20. Here's another 20 or $40 per shooter. And so this would be the first come out roll, and then the CB, what is the CB? It's a $20, the equivalent of this is the $20 come bet CB. Oh my goodness, this is amazing. All right, we're just gonna roll it out and I'm gonna show you how to get over and out, okay? So we're gonna have to keep this here. We're gonna be up on the four and 10, the puck is off and we are not working, we are off as well. So technically you would start like this, you'd have $40 ready to go, okay? And then somebody would be shooting the dice or rolling the dice. And if you're rolling the dice, then uh, you would have to have a pass line or don't pass. But if you're not shooting the dice, I never recommend playing the pass or don't pass if you're not shooting the dice, especially not the pass. But if you want to get just get your money out there, do, do it the way I'm doing it here, okay? Uh, well, you know, I'm not a pro. Wait, wait, am I a pro? I don't know if I'm a pro, but I will say <laughs> a pro not meaning professional, okay? I'm just pro status, like I'm pro craps. That's what, no, I guess that's already a YouTuber name, but I'm a YouTuber, I guess. Okay, okay, I'm a YouTuber. All right, Holy Roller here, getting ready to have a come out roll. We're not rolling the dice, so we don't need this right here. We don't need a, a, a pass or a don't pass. Here we go. Let's see who rolls and what they get. They got a nine, so the point is nine. And because we have the nine, now we have our $40, right? We got 10-4, so we put $20 in and we say 10-4, or you could say 4-10, but it just sounds better if you say 10-4, dice uh, dealer buddy. <laughs> and then you do a $20 come bet. All right, here we go. Let's see what happens. And it rolls and it is a five. So this come bet moves to the five. Now, all we have to do is get one of these to hit. Let's see what happens. Oh my goodness. And that's the whole strategy. Look, it's a five, folks. It's a five. What is that? That pays $20, okay? Now look, $20, $20. We are over and out, all right? We're over and out, meaning that we are out of the hand and we have a four and a 10 for absolutely free. All right, now, let's see if we can get a four and 10, to, four or 10 to hit, and there's a six. Okay, the point is nine, That's that'll be fine too. And there's a five, whoa, another five. And there is the nine, we got the nine, and it is a winner, 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 okay? We're out of this hand. They are gonna shoot again and roll again, these are paid for, right? So we're not gonna go back up until one of these others hit. We need the 10-4, right? We're already over and out, all right? So there's a six, the point is six. So I know what you're saying, you're like, over and out means you're leaving the radio. There's a nine. Uh, but we're not leaving the craps table. We're just, there's a seven, there's a seven. The, the dice are over and out, how about that? Okay, so <laughs> there we go. 
Have you got your dice tracker yet? Make sure to get one of these. Go to holyroller.com or check the link in the description. This is able to track not only your bankroll, but your points towards a free cruise, among other things. So make sure to grab one of these. Now let's get back to it. So that shooter is over and out. You know what I'm saying? So now we're going to go back again. Let's get our $20, our $40 ready. Sorry, 20 and 20. So we're going to get the 20 ready. And, and we're just going to have it right in our hand ready. We're not the one rolling the dice. Here we go. 10-4 CB radio. That, that would be good. How about 10-4? No, 10-4 CB radio over and out. <laughs> That's the name of this strategy. Um, <laughs> and it's a seven. Well, they had a frontline winner. That's called a natural for whoever was on the pass line. Whoever's on the don't pass just uh, lost. Okay, here we go. And it is a 10. The point is 10. So now that the point is 10, do we go up on the 10? Yes, we do. We say 10, four, good old buddy. And we have 10 and four. And then we have our $20 coming, $20 comeback. Here we go. Let's see what happens. And it's a 12. Oh my goodness. This loses on two, three, 12. It wins on seven, 11. And then it goes to the point and comes back if you hit it again, just like you saw before. But because this was a 12, we lost this. So now how do you get over and out? Uh, we need to hit a 10 and a 4. A 10 fork. 10 4. Let's get it. 10 4. How about an 8? How about an 8? No, 10 or 4. And uh, you know, there's only three ways to make a 10 and three ways to make a 4. That was a 9. Uh, three ways to make these each. There's that 12 again. Wow. There's only one way to make that one. So we have six combinations out of 36. There's a yo, drop a dot to make it a 10. How about that? And uh, there's the seven out. Wow, so this one, talk about over and out. We, uh, we, we're not over our bankroll, we are out of $40 right there. Remember we got it back last time? So we've had two shooters and we're down $40. So. We're 50-50 right now. Let's see. Let's see if we can keep this going and actually be better than 50-50. Okay, so here we go. Uh, you, as sooner or later, you're going to have to roll the dice. So how would you roll the dice? And some casinos allow this, some don't. But if you have $40 and you don't want to spend more than $40, you can do, and I know this will work on a Royal Caribbean ship, you can do a pass line and a don't pass. Okay, this will zero out your money. Like if you win or lose, you're gonna either win or you're gonna lose. The only thing that you that would have you lose ten dollars is if a twelve rolls, because this wins on two three, it pushes on a twelve. This wins on seven eleven. So if this wins and this loses on seven eleven, right? So that would be like that. If this loses on two three twelve, so if a two or three hit, that would win. If a 12 hits, you lose this and you lose $10. Okay, so one combination out of 36, we're hoping doesn't roll right now. And we're rolling the dice and we have our $40 in our hand. So we could do our 10-4 CB radio, good old buddy over and out. Okay, so here we go. Let's see what we get here. Maybe make it not be a 12. There we go, that's good. It's an eight. So the point is eight. So whether we get an eight or a seven, this breaks even. So this is where we can roll without spending money in our bankroll because we have 10-4 and $20 coming, right? 10-4, good old buddy, CB radio, over and out, crap strategy. Here we go. <laughs> and it is a six, a hard six, by the way. So this moves to the six, and now that's a bet on the six. Let's get that six or a 10 or a four. There's a five. There's a five. How about a 10 or a four or a six? Hard six again. Hard six back to back. I mean, we didn't see another six. I mean, we saw a, we saw a five, but but look, there we go. We are, what are we? We're over and out, good old buddy. Now let's get a four 10. Yeah, that would be great. And uh, there's a yo, yo 11, yo 11. And they say, they call it a, there's a four, we got it. We got it. Now that is $18, okay? So that that's gonna pay 18. Now that's almost the 20, but, Let's do this, $18, we can collect it because remember we lost a little bit, so let's collect this one, but if we were up in our bankroll, we would probably get like an $18 eight or six or something like that. But right now, right now, we're just going to collect it because we know we're down 40, but not, 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 not all 40 because we just got 18, all right? 
And the reason why they call it a yo, yo 11, is because 11 sounds like, ooh, the number right there that we don't like to talk about when the puck is on. I shouldn't even have thought about it. Oh no. Oh, hard 10, yes. That is amazing, because that is, I'm gonna throw in $2, and I'm gonna get two for 20 right there, okay? So remember when we lost 40, we just got 38 of it back. So we're only down $2 altogether. Let's see if we can get one more hit, and then we can actually be up, you know? Let's see what happens, let's see what happens. There's a four, we did it, we did it. Now, this is the thing, it's another $18, right? And you might say, you should be pressing those numbers, you know, or adding some pressure, you know, uh, making the bet higher. No, no, let's not do that yet. Let's do this. Let's bring $6 back to our rack, and let's get a six, and $6 back to our rack. How about that? Yeah, that sounds good. Uh, now we're kind of spreading out because we're over and out, you know what I mean? We're over and out. We're out of the hand. We're making money now. There's a nine. Let's see if we can get a six, four, or ten. There's a five. Wow, that's what the dice do. They're like, what do you not have bet? Okay, boom, boom. That's what I'll roll. All right, here we go. <laughs> let's see. Let's see. There's the eight. We did. I almost put that on the eight, but I didn't. Now, so this don't pass because the, uh, the don't pass is a bet that the seven will come before the eight. And the pass line is a bet that the eight would come before the seven. So this one lost, but this one won. Okay, so that's how we were able to roll for free as long as we get past that 12, you know what I'm saying? All right, let's see if we can get past that 12 one more time. <laughs> Here it is, and it's a five, it's a five. So the point is five this time. We still have that six because we're over and out. So this is all free money here. You know, we have our money back, right? All right, there's a six. We got it. All right, so a six, and that pays $14. Okay, let's throw in 15 for, I mean, let's throw in one and we'll get 15. So $14, we throw in one, we get 15. Let's go ahead and rack that. We're going to go ahead and rack that just so we can say uh, we almost got. We're $4 in, but remember, we got this, this $20 here. So we're up no matter what. All right, let's see if we can get a 4 or a 10. That would be cool. A 4, oh, the 7 out. The ugly number. Well, for some people. All right, so there we go. Uh, this person wins, this person loses, but for us, we just broke even, right? Because we were able to get past that 12, you know, on the first that first roll. So we're not the roller, we're not the shooter anymore, but look at this. We got profit, we are up. We are up $16, folks, $16. All right, let's do one more shooter, and then you can uh, tell me in the comments if you would play this strategy with $400. It's called 10-4 CB Radio Good Old Buddy Over and Out Crap Strategy, all right? So here we go, we're gonna do, we're gonna do our $20 and our $20, so our $40, $20 and $20 in hand. Somebody else is shooting because we just did and we lost, you know, although we didn't really lose here. All right, <laughs> here we go. And it is seven. Well, that's them That's them being a natural, a natural. Seven and 11 right now is called natural. Let's see. And there is a nine. Nine Nina, they call it center field nine. All right, so we're gonna do a 10-4 good old buddy dealer and uh, CB or a come bet, <laughs> come bet. And we wanna get over and out of this hand. Here we go. Let's get over what we put out there. There's a 10. Okay, here is a great scenario because we win, okay, we win $18, okay? We win $18. Now this moves to the 10, now we could take this down. So look, we have 25 and we have uh, $28 back out of our 40, okay? Now all we need is one of those and we'll be out. We'll be over and out. All right, here we go, there's a five. Let's see if we can get a 10-4. Now we're still on that 10-4, good old buddy. There's another five, oh my goodness. The five is the other side of the nine, by the way. Let's get a nine, I don't care. <laughs> there's a six. There's a six, uh, uh, five, one, they call it. There's a hard eight, a four, four, square pair, they call that one. And there is another eight. Oh my goodness, what about the four and 10? Don't forget about it, Mr. Dice. There's another eight. There's so many eights, I cannot believe it. How about the 
Nine, okay, there's a nine. At least the nine hit, uh, so that goes like that. Now, this bet is always working, and this bet is off when that puck is off. So if we get a come out 10, that would be great right now. Let's see if we can get a come out 10. Here we go. Um, it's an eight, it's an eight, so we got an eight, and so we're gonna, we're gonna go ahead and mark the eight. Now, the, now, that, now that's working. Let's, now we could get a four, I don't mind. Here we go. Let's see what happens. Oh, there's a six. Man, look at this roll. I mean, come on, how about a 10? 10, oh, there's another six. How come this rolls, this rolls like this when we don't bet them? You know what I mean? We don't bet them and they hit over and over and over. How about point hit? Okay, again, this is working, this is off because the puck is off, this is off. We could say working by putting a, we could override it if we wanted to, but we're not going to. Okay, we're just gonna play that four. I mean, that 10, let's get it, let's get the 10. And it's a hard six. Wow, I've never seen so many hard sixes in one roll before. Oh my goodness, how about a nine? A nine? No, we want a 10 or a four. That's what we're looking for. There's the hard 10, it finally came. And you know what that means? $20 gets paid, gets paid. So what do we do? We go back up on the 10 because we have all of our $40. Let's see how much we have. We actually, let's see how much we have because we put $40 in, okay? So there's 20, there's 40, and look, we have extra money for this shooter. We are over and out, you know what I'm saying? We're over what we put in, so we are out. This is a great way to think about craps as well. Get over and out on every strategy that you do. All right, here we go. 10-4, good old buddy, let's get over and out. <laughs> <laughs> there's a six. There's a six. Let's see how much money we win on this one, you know? Oh, seven out. See, I got greedy. Right when you get greedy, the dice will remind you that you got greedy. They'll let you know. All right. So he, let's see where we're at as far as our bankroll, because here's our 400 that we started with. And we are, let me see, what do we got? 25, 30, 34 dollars that we're up in just a few shooters with the crap strategy called 10-4 CB radio, good old buddy over and out crap strategy. Thank you for watching. Watch this video if you'd like to see more and subscribe if you haven't already. And I hope to see you cruising and rolling on a craps table soon. See ya.